The London Day Game model, in my experience, is a pile of shit. I don't think it's very good. I think it's inefficient. You can get results from it. You can get laid from it. You can get dates from it. I've gotten dates from it. I've gotten laid from it. It's not great. The problem is it's super inefficient because you're using fancy gimmicky gamey shit. Now, the problem is you go up to a chick, you do the London Day Game stuff. She knows you're a gamey weirdo, right? That's the first thing. She can sense that you're a gamey weirdo because you're being a gamey weirdo. She knows that this is a weird interaction, right? Not because it's the daytime approach, but because you're doing it in a fancy, gimmicky, gamey way. You're doing push-pull. You're doing the, like, stacking and all of this. It's super unnatural. It's not the way conversations are meant to go. But the London Day Game guys convince you that it is. The only way to prove to yourself that this is bad and the proper way to go about it is to use a different system. I recommend you do John Anthony's system. I did this, you know, I did 400 London Day Game approaches um, in the city that I used to live with, live in. And, um, you know, I got four dates from it. I have like 400 approaches. It's crazy. The, and it was really good because this was at the start of my pickup journey. So it was really instrumental in building my confidence. And to be fair, it, is, it got me out of my comfort zone and it grew my balls quite a lot. But in terms of getting actual results, in terms of, you know, powering your way to developing the skill set, it's really inefficient and you're just going to develop bad habits. Instead, follow John Anthony Lifestyle. That's what I did. I found his system and I just got like... It, it, it. I did night game using his system and I just got results on like night one and then night three and then I think like night seven or night six or something. Like it was just... It, it was just so much more efficient because you're not doing bad strategy. The London Day Game model works, but it works in an inefficient way. Like... I can touch my ear like this, or I can touch my ear like this. What's the easy way of going about it? Like this. John Anthony's way is the better way of going about it. The only way you can prove it to yourself is by doing the two different methods and comparing it. This has been my experience. I'm going to wrap up now. In conclusion, you know, you if you're trying the London Day Game model and you're not seeing like a huge amount of success, just try the different system for a bit. John Anthony's system, it's just un unreal. Um... And compare the two and you will be convinced you'll be a convert like me and you'll be you know the experience when i when i got like when i got my first result using the, the system like it was fucking crazy and it's like yeah i'm i'm just it's brilliant it's, i can't describe the feeling I'm, i might make another video describing the feeling that i felt because it was one of the best feelings, like, honestly, one of the best feelings of my fucking life. I swear to God, that moment of realisation where I realised I wasn't fucked in dating and I could actually, like, get results and it was normal and overcoming all those insecurities. It was a magical, magical, magical fucking moment. Really, you know, I was smiling. I can't, like, just, re like, rethinking about it. Wow, it was it was beautiful. Really, really beautiful. And it was this the, the sense of security and, you know, knowing that it's all going to be fine. <sighs> The relief, the elation, undescribable. I might try and describe another vid, but yeah. London Day Game Model, pile of wank. Try John Anthony's system, be open-minded. Try it, and then compare. Simple A-B testing. You'll find that it works way better.